GA4 will track the queries your users enter in site searches, providing you with valuable insights, but there's some setup required to see the queries within the reports dashboard. If you have a non-standard query parameter, then you'll need to add this within the data stream settings, as GA4 only looks for five search parameters by default. Once tracking is set up, head over to the Explore tab and create a new report. If you start with a template, then you'll already have some segments, dimensions and metrics imported. All you need to get started is the event name and search term dimensions. Drag search term onto the rows section to view individual search queries, and then you can also drag and drop further metrics like event count. In the filter section, add event name exactly matches view search results to remove the not set row, which is caused by events other than searches shown in the report. You can then go further by creating a funnel exploration tab and define the steps as a site search event followed by your primary conversion. This will provide you with a conversion rate for sessions which involve a site search, and by adding a breakdown based on search terms, you can see the conversion rate for these app terms as well.